We are going to Sephora. Mia's gonna drive. <sighs> That's dangerous, right? No, see, sure. Sephora. <laughs> <laughs> my beautiful friends look what i have here Hi. hey we got a me i'm so excited the last time that i did a sephora haul you really enjoyed it that i ended up doing it inside my car but today we're inside mia's car we just came back from shopping at sephora because the sephora savings event is about to end it ends this coming monday april <laughs> Oh. April 24 it's like one month for him yeah Monday April 24 I will be leaving all the details all the links absolutely everything will be on the description box below you know those who are Rouge members you get 20% off those who are VIVs you get 15% off and those who are insiders you get 10% off the code again all those details will be on the description box below along with all the details of all the products that we shop so we find some great stuff at my local Sephora and I just had a lot of fun with Mia and she's she's in a rush right now so we're gonna try to do this really fast but Mia can you open a little bit that window please because it's so hot in here we're trying to do not turn on the um, air conditioning so it doesn't there you go <laughs> do you want to start with your bag see what you have in there okay so I got the Olaplex number no. 9 bonding um, protector. I like use it after I'm done with the shower, like I, like put in my hair and then afterwards I blow dry it. Or you can just use it as a leave-in, but it's really good. I like this product. Yeah. It's really good to protect your hair. And, yeah. I mean, she has gone through tons of it. In fact, she is the one who put me into it. I, I remember when he lunch and then I didn't really want to pay much attention to it and then she showed me and I'm like but that's a serum and she's like no it's also hair protectant and I actually use it today and it did my hair really nice and she likes when I put my hair like when I style my hair like straight straight so I did it for her today because we were gonna go out I don't know if she noticed it, she noticed uh, it? So usually they're like <laughs> big like curls yeah and she doesn't like it that much she likes when I do like straight straight so and she does use the Dyson Coral with this product and mm -hmm. I used it today and you like it yeah it yeah works. yeah and I know a lot of you have been asking me about the Dyson Coral I use it from time to time but she's the one who uses it Every day. Every day. How do you like it? It's really good and then like straightens your hair like perfectly and it's like so easy to use because it has no cord. Yeah. There you have it. So if you have been wondering about the Dyson Coral, she really loves it. She also has her own um, Dyson Air Wrap, but she only uses it for blow drying, right? Or yeah. like just brush it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. There you have it. So yeah, let's keep going right here. What else? Yeah. So Sorry. how many of you got of these? Just one? Mm -hmm. Oh, there's... So we got a second one of those as well. Yeah. So we got two right here. And we got these um, high tops, like the curlers for when you blow out your hair. Mm -hmm. um, so she got it for her because she wants to try it out. Yeah, I want to try it out. I mean, like my hair, I have a lot of hair, so I don't need a lot of volume, but it would be nice to just try it and see. So I got one of these and it didn't cost that much, right? It was what? Like $12. Bucks, $12 or something like that. Yeah, it was, it was a good price. Mm -hmm. And then we also got two of the money hair masks. Oh yeah, actually I got more right here. So what I did is what happened is I have gone shopping without her a couple days ago and I also have some boxes here that have arrived. So yeah, but what do you think? I like this hair mask. I use it instead of using conditioner, I just use this and it like makes my hair super silky and I, really, like, I love it. Yeah, super manageable and like this is, I just wash it. So look at that. It's Silky, 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 silky. Yeah, really nice. Mm -hmm. I also got, well, she got it for herself. It's the Glow Screen by Supergoo. Mm -hmm. So on my last haul, I grabbed, actually, I grabbed the large, the value size. But today, I went ahead and grabbed the regular size because that's the only one that was available in the shade Golden Hours. So 
um, Supergoop now has four different shades. It doesn't really have a tint. It's just a little hint of color. So I was thinking, you know, as I'm going to get a little bit bronze up for summertime, it will be nice to have something a little bit more golden in tone. So they still have it available at my local Sephora, and I, I decided to pick it up. I got okay, also... Okay. I got also the replica under the lemon trees perfume. You gonna open it and this is spray it? Yeah. I came prepared. I put some stuff here on Mia's car. <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> so, well, you can try it on your skin too. Oh. <laughs> Why does it come like three billion boxes? I know. Yeah, so she tried Beach Walk. She doesn't like it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. you don't like it, right? I don't like what else? What else? Trying Lazy Sunday. Lazy Sunday. No, Lazy Sunday. I didn't like, but Beach Walk. It was like mid. It was like, it was like all right. The scent, like, like you can really smell it. Mm -hmm. You wanna try it on your skin or here? Yeah, your skin. This smells good. Yeah, what it smells like, Lizzie. Mm, it's lemony. It's very fresh. It actually it smells like if you are under a lemon tree, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It smells like capri in a way, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, when you're at like a restaurant or a little, you know, like... No? Mm -hmm. It smells like that. It smells so really good. Do you like the bottle? Yeah. You know, like <laughs> it's like nice. It's like it's like textured. It's like, like linen, right? Yeah, it looks like fabric, like a linen. Yeah, they, they did a really nice job on that. Do so you have a cup? No, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Oh, good. Okay, that's perfect. So I'm happy she found the fragrance because many, like what, two years ago, you spray something, right, from this brand and you really like it, but we didn't buy it. She was like, no, that's okay. She took, I remember it was Dolce Gabbana something, right? Yeah, like, no, the, um, it comes in like a yellow bottle. Yeah, she took that one and then she, she didn't regret it, but she then, she was, always thinking about the friends so i'm thinking it's this one because i know it was not beach walk yeah okay and then we also got this um first aid beauty body scrub i've never used this but i have a friend who's used this and she said it like she had like you know like little bumps that come up on your skin she used it and it took away all those bumps so yeah the kp and then i have heard too that this is really good if you have self tanner and it's just a little bit patchy that it makes it super easy to remove it and she loves to use self tanner and it's something that i always hear from her oh i have a little patch here right so yeah. i asked her if she wants to try it and she said yes so I think that would be good. Perhaps she can try it this weekend, and then if she likes it before that sale ends, we can buy another one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then this one. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna put. <laughs> so then I also got this Laneige um, lip glow balm. I like this because it's like really moisturizing. Let me show them. Yeah. It's really moisturizing. It doesn't really last that long, but I like this color. Like, cause they have like different scents, but they have like different tints to them. But I like how this color, like, shows up on my skin and it keeps it moisturized for, like, a good bit of time. Yeah. And it leaves it, like, glossy as well. That's what she was telling me. Like, I we wear there, and I personally like the one that is gummy bear, the gray one. Um, it smells kind of like a grape Fanta. And she told me, no, I like this one better because it leaves a hint of pink in there. So that it makes, you know, the lips as they have, you know, just, just a hue of of pink right yeah mm -hmm. All right. and then i got so we looked at two of the different dior like lip like they're like lip oils i guess right? well so. she looked first at the lip oil and then she grabbed the cherry one and she was like oh i want it and and then she saw these ones which mm -hmm. are the lip maximizers and then she's like maximizer will, will it plumb my your lips, lips. <laughs> you know? and i'm like yes it will plumb your lips so um I told her too that I have a ton of <laughs> but she wanted to pick up her shade. So you want to show the shade like that? Yeah. So I got the shade. It's the shade um, 007 Raspberry. Mm -hmm. It's a really pretty color. You want to? I can't be better. <laughs> Obviously with the Chanel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And that was actually a gift from one of my subscribers. So yesterday I put up a video that it was a Chanel haul and I it's just only Chanel stuff that I got 
And um, one of them was these that it wasn't a whole lot because I didn't bought it myself. But yeah, like like I said, a subscriber was so kind to send it to me. Why do, why do we have these lines right here? I don't know. Oh, it's starting to focus on both of us. Kind of thing, right? Yeah. Okay. I thought, look, it's like pinky, but it's, it's not like so too pretty. Yeah, yeah, it's a little bit like tingly, but not like super. Mm -hmm. Like the lip injections, like that's like tingly. Like that's like burning your mouth off. Yeah, that is no bueno. But this is really nice. It tastes yeah. like if you have toothpaste on your mouth. It mm -hmm. feels like if it has toothpaste on mm -hmm. your mouth. And it looks really pretty. It looks natural. You just have a very like light hint. Yeah, it has a very light hint of color. I decided to pick up this Glow Recipe Strawberry BHA Pore Smooth Blur Drops. Now, you know I have a large pores right here, and I like to use a blurring kind of primer. So I was thinking, you know, maybe I should give it a try. And this is just so cute, and they still have it available at my local Sephora. I think it's still available online, actually. So I'm going to try it. The only thing with this that I'm just... You know a little bit not concerned but just thoughtful of is that it has it's a serum so you have a what is it a bha in here and you have to be kind of cautious with your skincare so that's something that i need to remind myself you see that it's not focusing well but, so it's something that i have to remind myself about it uh, and I'm sorry, I don't know if it's focusing well. It's just giving us a little, right? Kind of weird. Okay, okay we're trying to get closer, right? <laughs> focus. But anyhow, it's something that I'm going to try and see how it goes, um, you know, under makeup, obviously, because they are promoting it as a primer. And I also picked up the K18 Bio... Oh, when I was talking about the Chanel mirror, <laughs> um, it's something that I order that I order it online. It hasn't arrived yet, but it's a gift set from Chanel. Uh, is that Chanel Chance Tantra? I think it's the EDT or the Eau de Parfum. I don't remember, but it comes the 3.4 fluid ounces, big size, and then also a spray for like travel spray. Anyhow, then I went ahead and picked up the K18 Biometric Hair Science Molecular Repair Hair Oil, which is supposed to repair your hair from the molecular level. And this is not cheap. It was like 60 something dollars, right? Almost $70. So you use the K18 too, right, Mia? Once in a while, like when I go get my hair done. Yeah, I use it a little bit more often than hair, but it's really good. It's a really good product. So I really didn't need it a hair oil, but knowing that it's new, knowing how expensive it is, and knowing that I use hair oils, I was thinking, you know, perhaps we can both, you know, try it and see how we like it. Um, yeah, that's that. And then I bought a fragrance too. And this one, it is um, by Dolce Gabbana, and it is... L'Emperatrice. Um, let me open it up. I it was the last bottle by me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So she liked it actually when she ah. Why? Can you stop it? I know. It's like this box. I just want to open. Okay, here. And there's actually an well actually like two new fragrances from Dolce Gabbana. One is um New flanker from the what's it called? Light blue. Light blue. Uh -huh. And the other one is I don't remember the name, but it has a little crown. But they didn't have it available at Sephora. This kind of like throws me off a little because it has the cap like this, but it has a little spray. I have another fragrance here, so let, let me just try it. Let's see what yeah things. Okay. I, I think it smells really good. It smells good. It smells like clean. It smells clean. It smells also kind of like if if you have been at a winery, you know how when it's the the, the grape, the, the grape when it's on the not on the well, on yeah, the barrel on the barrel, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's how it smells. Well, it's because we live um, in a wine country, so <laughs> yeah, so we kind of like that in our mind okay so let's see what else did I got oh this is something that I got online is a new 
um, Killian can't stop loving you. So I want to hear her thoughts about it. So look at that. So pretty. The bottle, I mean, very typical for Killian. Love the sides. So pretty now. This, this is new. And there's some new fragrance also by Killian that is not yet at Sephora. Let's see what she thinks of it. Be honest. It's like alright. It's alright? Mm -hmm. What it smells like? I don't know. It smells like... Like weird alcohol smell. Mm. It's a little bit... Seems like woody. Like woodsy, right? Mm -hmm. it smells kind of woody. But at the same time, there's some freshness and musky into it. I really do not know the notes of this fragrance. But to me, it smells really good. But it's something that obviously her age... She will not use something like this at all. You know, she will like something more fresh and whatnot. Then I went ahead and pick up another one of the Biggie Biggie Beige Floor Elastin Cream. Uh, you want to smell it? Because she hasn't smelled it just I yet. I smelled it. Before? Yeah? At the store, I didn't like the smell of it. Really? Mm -hmm. mm. Well, I got another one for me. <laughs> it smells kind of like Baccarat Rufa. No, it doesn't really. It does smell more like the Burberry hair. Oh, let's see. Oh, yeah. oh, we have music going on. Our neighbor. He likes to play the drums all night long. <laughs> yep. Okay. Okay. Right. I don't like the smell of it. She doesn't like the smell. Okay. And then I also got another one of the Real Radiance Cream. This is a new one. Let me tell you, it doesn't have any radiance. I thought it was <laughs> it was gonna have some radiance. It doesn't. I decided to pick up another one because I kind of like the scent. It's a little bit fresher. Let's see what you think about it. Yeah. Oops. Smell. It smells good. It really smells like like fresh, like a little bit more tropical, like tropical, but like vanilla tropical. Mm-hmm. Like, even with, it seems like it has, like, a hint of pineapple, too, huh? Yeah. Yeah? But which one do you like the most out of the Sol de Janeiro? The, the original, the Bum Bum. Bum Bum Cream. And actually, Mia, when we were there, she tried the, um, the oil, right? Yeah. How do you like it? Um, I don't know. It just smells... It just smells... <laughs> Sorry, Rob. It's, like, between the... It's, like, the... Should I just put the windows? Yeah, let's just close that window. Yeah, it's a little bit. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I when I like tried the firming oil, like it smelled good, but it also smelled like play doh as well. I don't know. It was just a mix of the boom boom cream and kind of play doh thing, right? Mm -hmm. So she's like, no, I like the uh the glow motion oil, the one that has a shimmering. Yeah, that one's nice. That's nice, yeah. So are you Mia, dangerous? It's like, you look dangerous. A lot of people ask me about this um, box opener. It's actually not really a box opener. It's like for self-defense. But I, I really like it. So I know a lot of people had asked me for it. So I will make sure to link it too. But here it's a box from Sephora. This is sharp though. Be careful. Stab someone with that. I know. So let's see. Oh, here. These are the new, well, not the new. <laughs> These are Valentino blushes. I love the blushes from Valentino. A lot of you had been asking me about these blushes, and I feel that they have a very, very nice, different, uh, very unique kind of um, formulation. Yeah, very unique formulation. It's kind of like creamy and beautiful. I got it in the shade 8. This might be a little too light. It look a little bit um, deeper on the promo images. So I don't know about that one, the shade number 8. And then I also got the shade number 2, gorgeous shade 2. Although it looks very much alike to Born in Roma. So I don't know if I'm going to keep it or not but yeah, I really wanted to get a couple more do I need it absolutely no I don't need it but there <clears throat> there you have it all right so there's a few things here for Mia oh. 
Okay, so again, the money mask. Another <laughs> two money masks. <laughs> we go through them a lot right here, yeah. so might as well. Because it's literally like my conditioner, so it's like... Mm -hmm. And mine too, so... Makes yeah. sense. And then the Olaplex um, number four bonding shampoo, two of them. Um, I like this shampoo. I think, like, it smells really good. It like, smells, like, fresh. And, I don't know, I feel like it does good for my hair. You know what? I'm going to be honest with you. That scent of these... You should get a poop. Focus. 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 Yeah. Um, I'm, so, if you're from Peru, and you have to... If you have ever washed your clothing with um, Pepa soap... <laughs> it smells like it smells exactly like that. It seems like if they have melted down. But the good thing is, I love I love this shampoo too. It's really, really, really good. It's a really good shampoo. It leaves the hair very manageable, and it smells good too. It's just like it's funny because it just brings me memory when I wash my my clothing by hand. <laughs> <laughs> but it's really good. <laughs> and then the Glossier um, You Perfume. I would take it out of the packaging. Wait, should I? Yeah, it's kind of weird, the packaging, right? I know, that's weird. Uh, I don't remember. When it came, like, because I have this perfume already, but, like, when it came the first time, it like, just came, like, just like this. Just, like, the bottle, not even, like, this packaging. But it's gotten, like, way more expensive, like, since, like, Glossier got popular. Like, I remember when they, like, first, like, launched it, I got it. And it's because, like, my coworker, she had it, and I like the smell of it. Yeah, yeah. So I really love how it smells on her. On me, it smells like? Like, I don't know. Like sweat. Like sweat. Yeah. So it is second skin kind of fragrance. So it does have a little bit of, like, a musky scent. Yeah. And it smells really good. It's a compliment getter too, right? Mm -hmm. People will ask you, what are you wearing? Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, it doesn't work well for me or the well the way that I perceive it. I like, I prefer Balaya by Perfums de Marley. But um, yeah, these fragrance, there's a good reason for the hype. If you want something that is second skin that smells really clean, musky, and that you will get compliments, yeah. you know, for it. It's a good one. And another thing that I want to mention too right now that she was talking about how popular this has become and how the price has gone up and that it's kind of hard to find too. Listen, if you if you have an app, the Sephora app, like say if you click say on one of the links, just even if it's out of a stock, check if they have it available at your local Sephora, either for pickup or same day delivery, you can still place your order on the app and just pick up your products without having to make the line or going through anything of that. Or you can just ask for same day delivery. And it's kind of like an Uber type of thing that it, they will take it to your house. So that's a really good thing that Sephora does too. Uh -huh. And then, oh, I bought two because... I bought three. Three. <laughs> <laughs> Two of the same shade, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, one is but for you, one is dry. They're letter lip um lip. Uh, they're lip butter balms mm -hmm, by Summer Friday. Summer Friday. And I have heard the best things about it. I know this shade right here is very popular, vanilla beige. So I, I really want her to try it and see if she likes it. So you know, she has too? gone. Yeah. Has gone viral, so here you want to clean your lips with. I came prepared, <laughs> or so I think. <laughs> so it's like <laughs> it's like red. Not really red. It's coral. Same thing. No, it's not the same thing because they have two new shades. One is actually red, and the other one is corally. It feels moisturizing. It almost feels like the Laneige. Let's see. And what's the smell? Oh, it smells like... Like sweet. Not like candy. Not like the vanilla cupcake kind of sweet. It just smells like sweet. Mm-hmm. And then you want to try the other one? Mm -hmm. But looks like that. <laughs> You're like... It doesn't really smell like anything. Actually, never mind. It tastes like vanilla. 
It's nice though. It's like moisturizing. Mm -hmm. Which one you like? That this one. The one, yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, do you like it better than the Laneige, or you will have to try it for a little more? I mean, I've tried to try it, like, to see how long it lasts, because the Laneige, it lasts for a bit, but then it goes away, like, and then, I just, like, because this is not, like, super glossy, the other one's, like, more glossy, like, from Laneige, but, I don't know. Sorry, I'm looking down, something <laughs> probably. Okay, so, uh, when we were at the store, they had one more of these Tatcha Strengthening Night time ritual that comes with the full size of the indigo overnight repair and i don't i haven't seen it online so i will try to look at it i think the last time when i show this same package i left the item number so when we were at my local sephora they had the last one and i decided to take it because the price was really good 95 dollars in addition to my discount just the cream itself, I think it's $92, and then you're getting the essence and also the silk peony. So that's that right there. And then let's see right here. What else she got? Okay, this is for my husband. So I got a couple of these. He loves this, the other one by Aqua Di Jo by Giorgio Armani. So he loves it, and I always replenish. So there's a few right there. And then, oh, I got this one right here is by Sol de Janeiro. Is a Real Radiance. Do you want to smell it and tell me your opinion? Put it this on me. Just want to spray it on my face. <laughs> it's not as good as like the... The boom boom. The boom boom. But it's nice. It's refreshing. It smells kind of more pina colada, right? Some idea? Sort of, yeah. Hmm. I don't know. I just like... I feel like when I first sprayed it, it smelled like when Daddy was making the pisco. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's making the piece cool. Okay. All right. So that's that. And okay. What else is in there? Um, the, the Gisu um lip oil. Oh, is it is this for me? <laughs> yeah. You excited? <laughs> yeah. Cause okay. So I already have this, and I like love it. I like it makes my lips like look like super glossy and like plum. Like it doesn't plump it, but it's just like it makes it look plump because of how glossy it is. And um, it is moisturizing, and it keeps moisturized, moisturized for, like, a good amount of time, like, at least an hour. Mm -hmm. um, it is really expensive, like, in my opinion, like, for what it is, you yeah. know. But it's really nice. Yeah, I mean, I think it's reaching the price of, like, Dior. Yeah. You know, and I know this is a brand that is now well-recognized, but for many people may feel like, you know why that is high of a price but it's really good like she says and it just stays longer right too it stays long too yeah. it's like it's i feel like it's as good as like i feel like it's a little bit better than the laneige like personally to me okay and then um the makeup by mario what is this this is the a um shaping a stick it's basically a uh, a bronzer. So this one I actually bought it for me. <laughs> Just to check it out because it has been so popular and sold out. So I got it in the shade medium. And then the last thing, right? Is, oh no, yeah. we have one. Oh, I have a couple of things right here. Yeah, so this is the Dior Attic Lip Sugar Scrub. So this is really good on the go if your lips are chapped. It's got, it looks like a lipstick basically. Like this. And then, you know, it's just to scrub it. There you go, yeah. <laughs> it feels good. Mm -hmm. And it smells good too, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the lip maximizer. And I think the shade is really pretty too. Because if you're thinking about the lip oil in cherry, this one in raspberry is looks pretty much the same, but it gives you that benefit of that plumping effect without being painful. Mm -hmm. You know, so that's that. And then, oh, I just want to bring it to your attention. I'm sure you have perhaps seen already my review on the new Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Glow Blushes. They are are amazing a lot of you were asking me what I feel about these ones versus the Valentino Valentino they have a very different formula they are a little bit more radiant these ones they land a little bit more they have a subtle radiance but not as much as the Valentino ones they are super soft and the beautiful thing about them too is that they are blurring it's like you're having like a filter effect like and then 
I, again, I mean, I don't want to repeat myself. Go and check my review. But if you're thinking about the Gucci, I love the Gucci. They are more silky than these ones. They have that, you know, silky radiance that is just so fantastic. So, I mean, it's up to you. These land a little bit more like soft, kind of like a soft matte, you know? Like, mm -hmm. She has the Gucci ones. How do you like the Gucci ones? I like the Gucci blushes a lot. Like, uh -huh. It's really pretty and it like it's not too intense, but it's like the perfect amount and it lasts. Uh-huh. And then looking at them like these ones, if you're looking at them, um I know you haven't tried them, but do you see any difference like on the finish from the pan? Between mm, these I and the like Gucci. Gucci's a little bit more shimmery on top. Yeah, not shimmery because it doesn't like, have like glitter. Glowy. Like glowy. Glowy radiance. Yeah, it has a um, more of a radiance. Okay, my friends, and this makes it... Oh, no, the last thing. The last, last thing is by the necessary. I got the body wash, another one. And you know what? Online, they have a refill body wash. So I think I'm going to go with that, too. I got this time the one in um, Eucalyptus. This smells like a spa, right, Mia? Yeah. Okay. So, oh, <laughs> that's a little thing. <laughs> okay, friends. Well, thank you so much for being here. I hope that you enjoy this video with my daughter, Mia, and that it give you a perspective from, you know, another age. Um, on my fourth floor, she is, she's still on her 10th floor. <laughs> right no your one no your first floor sorry first floor. <laughs> oh my gosh okay well thank you so much for watching if you like this video please give it a thumbs up share with family and friends if you haven't subscribed yet i invite you to subscribe come and follow me on my instagram and tiktok and if you're not done watching my content i will be leaving a couple other videos right here that i'm sure you're gonna love until the next time i hope you have a beautiful wonderful, wonderful day, day. Bye. bye, -bye.